Hi everyone, it's Annie here and I've got my beautiful um, baby Grace with me. I'm just trying to get you in, make sure you can see her. There you go. Hopefully you can see her fine. Yeah, so we've got Grace here today. It's um, Tuesday morning. Oh, it's actually Tuesday lunchtime now actually, but I've been busy packing and doing household chores and washing ready for our holiday. But I just thought I'd come in and do a changing video of um, my darling little um, Grace. Um, and I thought I'd share um, a new outfit with you that I got at the show. I don't know if you remember the one that I got. Well, I'm going to put her in this today, which is absolutely gorgeous. I can't, couldn't wait to put her in it to <laughs> see what she looks like. Um, but I thought I'd show you these little dummies that I made for her. Um, because she's got a lovely open mouth and it goes quite a way back. What I've done, I've just um, done my usual trick of cutting the nipple off to a different shape and then putting silicone in the middle, um, silicone glue. Um, and then forming a, a little teat like that and they fit perfectly and um, that one as well which I think is really cute so I'm going to change her and here's a little bottle that we got from the show we've got formula in it now or made up formula <clears throat> but this little outfit looks so cute and she went to see her nanny on uh, sun well Saturday because we stayed over the night, we stayed with my mum Saturday night which we had a lovely girly night indoors, it was really lovely and we played with her dolls and it was really nice and she really enjoyed it my mum um, but she's in this gorgeous little outfit and I remember who um, sent me this, it's from Auntie Suzanne in Australia sent this letter from Baby Bunting um, Reborn, so she sent me um, this outfit and it is absolutely gorgeous on her in fact it's really sad to take her out of it, I really love it and especially with this little top um, that I got from um, John Lewis as well underneath. Um, this little, um, uh, what do you call it? I forget what the name of it now. It's just a little, um, oh my goodness, I've forgotten what it's called. A smock top, like a little smock top. Um, yeah, so she's in that. But um, mum absolutely loves her as soon as she saw her. Um, I don't. I didn't know what she'd say actually because Mum's not really sort of keen on open mouths. But as soon as she picked her up, she just she just fell in love with her. She didn't want to put her down. She just kept cuddling her the whole time we were there. <laughs> didn't she? Your nanny loves you. But um, yeah. So as I said, we're busy packing. Um, I've had to come into um, my bedroom today because um, I've got my case out on the spare bed in the nursery and um, getting all my things together ready to go on holiday um, so we're really all looking forward to that we've only got our currency yesterday um, I took Letitia into the city and um, got some few bits and pieces that um, just we needed last minute bits and pieces for the holiday so yeah, so we're really looking forward to that. And Sam, my stepson's going to come over tonight just to check um, that he knows how to look after the budgies while we're away. Because um, he's going to stay here while we're away, look after the house and keep an eye on the birds, keep them company. And that'd be nice for him to have a little bit of a break really, for, like on his own, so um, he can do what he wants and just chill out and things, so that'd be good for him um, what we've got to do today I've got a couple of little things I need to finish off um, sewing wise um, because um, I'm going to send them they're actually going to America so I'm going to send them while I'm in America <laughs> which is uh, going to be better really because I know that they're in the country and they'll probably get there a lot quicker if I send them while, whilst I'm in America look at these lovely little pants aren't they gorgeous this little nappy cover it's got a little ruffle back to it so beautifully made I love it absolutely love this set it's gorgeous so I'm going to put her in this someone's asked me to make some of these nappy covers actually so I'm going to have a go at making some because I don't think they're too difficult what's my phone going off I don't know a little bit on the big side for her isn't it Bubby but we like things big don't we we don't like them too small and then I don't know about these I might have to um, 
I think what I'll do is just tie them up for now. I might have to chop them off because they're very long. Just put them in a little bow. But then they're quite handy to put round the <coughs> round the hanger. So you've got the hanger. Oh, I hope this isn't going to be too big on you. Mm. Might have to be for um for my ruby, but we'll see. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, I'll just turn you over a minute. It says naught to three months, so I think it's going to be alright. I think just the pants are quite big actually. Put a little bit more elastic in them or something. But then, other, you know, Ruby could use Ruby could wear this as well. So they always share their clothes, babies, don't we? We all share your clothes. So there we are. Oh, look at her! She's so gorgeous. I'd love the. Do you know what? I've bonded so quickly with this baby. It was like um, like when I got Sophie. Um, I just bonded really quick. Um, oh my goodness, and she look gorgeous. There's a little bit of cotton on there that I need to take off. Just put this, oh, I've got these little green socks here that absolutely match perfectly with the green in her outfit. So I was going to put those on, on her little feeties. I've nearly finished my um, Haley's, um sculpt she's nearly done I've nearly finished rooting I've been so busy though doing sewing projects now I haven't had a chance really to sit down I did about an hour and a half rooting last night um, <clears throat> but the mohair that I've got is actually <laughs> it's quite funny really I tell you this story I um, got this mohair and just to try it really and it's from a, uh, a goat called um, Bernard his name is <laughs> Um, and it just knots really easily I don't know why it's very very soft and it's beautiful once it's in but to keep it from knotting is a pain and um, I've wasted quite a lot of it so I was going to run out so I had to ring oh I'll get in touch with the lady that um, sold it to me and said about it and she's just sent me some more um, luckily she had some more left from the same goat so in the same colour so it matches perfectly so I'm going to have enough to finish now so I'm not going to worry too much about wasting it because I thought how on earth am I going to carry on without wasting any more oh my goodness can you see this baby I'm just going to brush her hair <clears throat> it's my phone keep going off I don't know who it is oh look at her hair it's so soft think of it even though this gets even though her hair gets messed up quite easily it just brushes back really well. I don't have to keep wetting it all the time. So she looks perfect. Look at her. I'm so grateful, Mandy, for you um, making this lovely baby girl for me. I really love her. I think I just might put a little bit on the front, actually. Put a bit on the brush instead. Oops. I'm really getting excited about our holiday now. Um, and my new job uh, rang this week and they said um, they've invited me to their Christmas um, party uh, which is going to be on the 9th of December and I don't start till the, the 5th um, so it'd be my first week and we're going to go out on the 9th so um, I thought that was really nice of them to do that, invite me to the party so that's good, so I'll get to meet a lot of the, the carers as well, you know um, hopefully at the do so yeah Oh my goodness, look at her. How cute does she look? I'm just going to put her little bunny back. I don't know if you can see her properly. Can you see her? Oh, look at her. <laughs> I think I might put this little passy back in actually, this one. I don't know where to put a bow, that bow back on her head or whether to leave it off. I don't know, because it does go. Doesn't it, sausage? It does go. Maybe I will put it on. Oops, I don't want to mess your hair. Trouble is, though, I, I hate messing it. You just do the hair and then you put a bow on and it just messes all the hair up again. Oh, I don't know. We'll sit up a minute so I can just get your bow on without trying to mess it up too much. Should I do it that way or that way? That way, I think. Oh, look at her. 
she is special she is so special there she is look at her sorry I keep saying look at her but I'm just so happy with her I really am I'm so proud I'm so happy 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 with her really really love her she's very special um, you know, I was thinking the other day actually because obviously I've seen my um, dream baby that I want and I don't know whether I ever get her because she's so rare to get hold of one, a Clara by Joanna Kazamarek, is it? Um, but I absolutely fall in love with that baby but I was thinking the other day, you know, I would sell apart from Grace because I can't think I ever sell Grace that I, you know, I would actually sell all my babies to get Clara, but I would have just Grace and Clara um, to get her, if one came up that is, but um, you know, she's just so rare, but I'm, I'm in no hurry, I can wait and I can save up and whatever, but you know, if I do um, get this silicone, then some of my babies will be going. Um, and as much as it breaks my heart, even Sophie, I mean, I just don't know whether I could part with Sophie either, but, oh, <laughs> it's really hard because I've got five, I've got four, sorry, four babies that I absolutely adore, four babies that I absolutely adore. I've got my Ruby, um, I've got obviously my Grace, um, I've got Matthew, and I've got Sophie, and I adore all of them. They are very special babies to me. Oh, and it'd just be so hard to part with any of them, but, you know, it can be over, I feel that four, I mean, I know I've got um, Eliana as well, um, but Eliana is, um, she was made by me, so I don't really count her as one of my collection, because I made her, she's my first practice reborn, really, so I don't really count her as part of my collection, but four babies... I think is enough. Um, I'm just happy with four. Um, I know I always said five, but I think four is enough. <laughs> and even like one or two would be enough. I, I just feel that sometimes it feels a bit overwhelming. So, um, you know, but we'll see. What If one comes up and it was meant to be, then it will do. So we're just, uh, we'll just see. But here she is, doesn't she look beautiful? So I'm going to carry on doing washing and packing and things like that. So um, I'm quite busy, but I will do another video on Thursday, which will probably be my last before I go away. Um, and I'll see you all then. Have a great Tuesday and a great Wednesday. Um, love to you all. Take care. Bye.